Hello family, welcome back to Becky Culture Media. I will bring to you trending news and events. If you hear the name Happy Boys, what comes to your mind? Do you remember one Matthew Precious Kelechi and Amako Johnson who rose to fame on social media after being fired from their jobs as security guards at Chicken Republic in Aba, Abia State? These guys were caught dancing while on duty. I, I don't know why they were dancing, but they were just, I think they were just trying to make people, um, just keep people entertained or make people laugh. It was obvious that they were just trying to, you know, make people relaxed, but they were being dismissed. They were, they were dismissed by Chicken Republic, the one, the Chicken Republic in Abia right so after that they became very popular online a lot of blogs posted them you know social media is where a lot of people can just make kids within a twinkle of an eye so yeah they got really 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 popular and people started you know sending sponsorship but this one was very attractive to them right they were granted scholarship to scholarships to study in Cyprus by the general overseer of the Omega Power Ministries, Apostle Chibuzo Chinyere. Now, you guys that do not know this man, this man is a philanthropist. He helps a lot of families, a lot of orphans, people who do not have where to go, people who do not have sponsorship. This man helps them a lot, right? So he took them to Cyprus, paid for everything, their flights, their school fees and all. So of recent, the famous happy boys took to their social media platform to reveal that they were dropping out of school. That was early this year in 2023 due to lack of financial support from their sponsor. They went further to say they, they shared chats right and they then, they then said that he was not sending money he was doing this and doing that you know but Apostle Chibuzo Chinyere responded he was so bittered he was really bittered because people were just coming for him like on social media you know how social media is guys they were coming for him that if you know you cannot sponsor this and that but there were people who were supporting him so anyway this information however raised a lot of controversial questions and angered their sponsor apostle chibuzo chinyere now reacting to this apostle chibuzo expressed his anger and began laying courses on the happy boys according to him he said the church was in charge of their sponsorship, right? He said the church was in charge of sponsoring their scholarship, including other benefits, which could be their books or everything they needed, you know. But due to the increase in dollar rates and dwindling the dwindling economic situation in the country, the church was not able to keep up with the sponsorship, but he was still doing a little, right? Because they, they showed their charts, right? Where they were asking for money for their rent, you know. But these boys, for, 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 I feel like these boys have been in Cyprus. Why they are doing, and then they are doing well on social media. Are they not getting gigs? Are they not getting other means of getting money at least they should look for other means of getting money to relieve their sponsor even a bit right this whole thing got apostle chibuzo really really sad that he came online and was laying courses guys he posted on facebook saying i place this course from the pain in my heart that doing good becomes evil that whosoever, no matter who that person is, that I used, he didn't pay one kobo. He didn't spend one naira. It is from offering and tithe that people drop in the altar. What other pastors used to buy, to buy private jets? I say, let me use it to help you. Now, I do you good. You use evil to pay me. You will remain poor forever. You can never achieve anything in life. 
as long as whether anywhere you are you suffer poverty you can never achieve you can't even buy one plot of land if there's if there are, if there's other clothes you bought through the money i used in sending you to cyprus you sell those clothes to feed you become so wretched wow wow this when i saw this early this year it was it was mixed emotions because yes of course what they did was very wrong but i don't know he was he was really sad that he had to cause them but i don't think causing is um you know the solution to you know all of this but anyway the news now i was giving you an introduction to uh what really happened backstory right but the news now is that these boys have been arrested anyway i remember after this chaos of uh apostle chibuzo telling them to come back to the country he actually told them he advised them to come back to the country that he is going to sponsor them in any nigerian university because there's a lot going on in nigeria and there's no money anywhere right he added that of all of this if that all everything was well communicated to them and they were offered an option of leaving cyprus to come finish their study right in either nigeria or benin republic now these boys blatantly refused they refused you know they went to cyprus with their manager so i think he was communicating what they should do and what they should not do there are three numbers right uh, with their manager right they refuse to come back they've been there they've just been they've just been so much drama a lot of drama going on but right now news reaching us is that they've been arrested in cyprus they've been remanded in an underground prison for no there's no there's no reason yet made known to the public the reason is still unknown till now but we really hope they are okay if you are being arrested in cyprus guys hmm, even being kept in an underground prison are you sure they have not done something really terrible or they have started doing really bad things in cyprus for me i feel like they should have come back to nigeria or maybe better still go to Benin republic because it's just close by here right this was what he could afford at the time but for them to still be in cyprus it means they are putting their hands into different things trying to make money trying to make people know that they have blown there were even charts showing how they were living a reckless life I'm going to put that up here but i really hope they are okay and yes you can send your prayers you know thank you so much for always listening to us thank you for always watching our video please give us a thumb up if you haven't and please subscribe to the channel hope to see you on our next video bye for now